We're riding with Jack again this morning. He's taking us to a tour bus to go up Huashan. So we've been handed off to another person to take us to the tour bus. So here we are ready to go up Huashan. Uh, everyone's carrying backpacks today because we've brought warm weather gear and that sort of thing because we really don't know what it's going to be like up there so we thought better to be safe than sorry. Looking at the gear other people have brought though, we may be over prepared. We're on our tour bus now. This tour is costing us 470 yuan, so um, that's close to $100. Um, basically that's uh, 100 yuan for the tour bus to and from, which is pretty good. And it's 150 entry uh, into the park, then 180 for the um, cable car ride up to the top. and. 41 for the bus within the park. Um, so you can do it cheaper than this. Uh, you could catch trains and things out to the mountain, but you'd still be paying your um, 150 entrance. Um, instead of the cable car ride, you could walk up the mountain, which takes about five hours. Um, but you'd still be probably looking at at least half what we're paying, so probably at least $50, or about 250 yuan. Uh, one way or another and it would take you a lot more time but you know it, it probably would be nice to walk up the mountain so if you had a bit more time than we have that might be the way to go we're getting lots of loud Chinese commentary on the way out which is quite annoying to be honest it's too loud it's actually quite a lot smoggier today than it was uh, yesterday in Xi'an and this over here to the left looks like the high speed train track that we came into town on. Our tour guide has a flag so hopefully we won't lose him. And we're now in some kind of air conditioned waiting room at the bottom of the mountain. The lady at the front of the room appears to be trying to sell everyone souvenirs. She's got someone up from the audience to demonstrate using this uh, shawl. And the infomercial continues for another product. Some posters on the wall of the room advertising these various products. And now we're in, uh, I guess, a warehouse shop and we can buy as many of these wonderful products as we would like. We're starting to think that uh, taking a tour that Jack organizes may not be such a good idea. So apparently it's not just Westerners who get sucked into these factory tours, uh, but the local Chinese as well. And interestingly, um, some of them are actually buying this stuff. So 
but we're back out in the car park and the whole thing took maybe half an hour 40 minutes so quite a waste of time really what did you guys think of that a little bit closer so I can hear it. A little bit violated. <laughs> Anyone else? Yeah, I just think it's a waste of time. I want to buy bamboo products. <laughs> I thought you would have got one of those shawls. <laughs> yeah. Almost. This place. This place. <laughs> the bus drove around the corner, uh, probably literally 50 meters, and uh, now we're going somewhere for lunch. And this is the crowded dining hall where we are lining up to get lunch on our way to Huashan. So it turns out that lunch in this place is 38 yuan, which is pretty expensive for lunch in China. And none of the guys are really that hungry. Um, but we have our tickets now for entry to Huashan and the car inside and the cable car. Uh, but we have to wait for everyone else to eat lunch before we can go in. So we're going to be waiting for about another 25 minutes or so. So this tour, probably not the best way to see Huashan. So in all with the mucking around and the shopping trip and the getting on and off the bus and all that sort of thing, looks like this is going to have wasted about two hours of our day. Um, so the guys are pretty annoyed about it. Um, in a way I kind of don't mind having done this once, <laughs> don't want to do it again, uh, but uh, you know, I've got it on camera for you and uh, you can learn from this little mistake and uh, it'll help other people to uh, not waste their time on another trip. trip. And now we're finally at the actual scenic reserve. And it's just before 12, so yeah, we've wasted about two hours with the extra bits and pieces on this tour. <laughs>